talking my shit. Yeah. Then I'd have flipped it again. I'd have took 10 out the 50, put the 40 up, and flipped another 10. Shit. Then been round, flouncing round, talking my shit, but not her. That fool seen that $10,000 in the bank, baby, and didn't know how to act. Had hit a lick, got an A check and a B go check. Oh, baby, you couldn't tell her a motherfucking thing. Shit. Uh-uh. You couldn't tell her shit, girl. Honey, she had a, she hit a bigo check. She had another bigo check coming. Baby, you couldn't tell her nothing. She was around here. She had hit some type of, some licks, huh? Could it then be doing old illegal ass shit? Oh, oh, this hair, girl, I finally got it took down. Lord have mercy. <laughs> I finally got it down, girl. Now I got to wash it and blow dry. But my hair appointment ain't till tomorrow evening. So I think I'm going to just wash it and blow dry it in the morning. After I drop Tuller while. Then has thigh pan cut it. Yeah, what part of the game is that? Why is you giving these men your money, girl? But over here, flounce. Girl, go sit down. Go sit down. Not impressed, huh? I am not impressed at all. Thank you. Thank you, bougie demeanor. The comedy show will be next weekend. Okay, we got to get us a flyer. So we're going to do the comedy show next weekend, y'all. And I'm going to ask DJ Fly to come so it could be like cracking. We're going to have music. We're going to have comedy. If it's any comedians, it's going to be lit. And if you know any other comedians, uh, Deacon Ray, let, um, you know, invite them. <clears throat> but, um. Uh, I need, we need a flyer. <clears throat> We're going to do it next weekend. And honey, you know, we be sitting up talking, honey. These people is copycatting and biting. Me and Pablo was talking about doing Chopped. Now all of a sudden the other folks acting like they done create pity and somebody else want to do a, a cooking show. Girl, I can't. Mm-hmm. But I'll get us one. I'll get us a flyer. But it's going to be what? Saturday or Friday? I feel like Comedy Club is like Thursday night. Maybe we maybe we could do Saturday and then if it go good. Because the Saturday night, we be needing something to do sometime. Friday night, too. Hey, Miss LaHorn. I say Saturday. I say Saturday. Child, she stood up and showed that stomach. Cut to the chase saying she... Can't speak on him. She don't know him. Her and Tommy are like, they don't know each other. She laughed now. I wonder if she know that Brandon started hating Pastor. Because he did. Oh, cut to the chase. Is that the lady's name? I'm, I'll laugh with her tomorrow. Is that the lady's name? Cut to the chase. First of all, Lady B is a, a a hater of anybody. That lady way more intelligent than her. 
Girl, just go on and leave that lady alone. That lady don't know you. She ain't starting no trouble with you. That's sad. Girl, just go on about your miserable business. Hey, my gram. You're right. Like, ugh. Now she bringing up that lady. That lady can, you know, she wasn't speaking negati negatively on Pete that I saw. I didn't see anything negative. Right, like, ugh. Girl, she'll be up. That lady ain't even into Bego like that, like the messy side. <laughs> Must be that pressure. Now, you know, um, I'm going to go ahead on and lay down and get back up and piss her off. <laughs> Girl, she be mad as a motherfucker. She be so mad. <sighs> and she already paid for her Millie. Her milli um and a half quota. She's already paid for that. So Eb just getting her hours, girl. <laughs> yeah, I said now she done already she she ain't even under no pressure. That just show you she thinks she could compete with me. That's all let's show you. If I'm already at a million and a half and I done paid for it. Girl, guess what I'ma be? Do my two hours and go to fuck the bed. Mm-hmm. Do my two hours and go and go to bed. That show you she was really just trying to compete with me. Uh-huh. Last night, girl, I got on about five, four, five o'clock <clears throat> early this morning. And baby, she was just finna end her life, but when she seen me live, she ain't ended. Sitting over there looking like a crack fan. Mm, what he been doing? He must have been around here talking shit. What he been saying? Uh-huh. What he been around here doing, Detroit thought? <laughs> they kicked his ass straight out of it. I said he must have been around here talking crazy. Now he been big and they don't kick him. He must be doing something. Not be beauty. Ah. <laughs> he's still a crackhead. Oh, he working. Is he? I seen him twerking out there on the dumpster. Somewhere I couldn't make out if it was another Burger King job or McDonald's. I knew it was some fast food. But why y'all kick him though? What he do? What he do next? Babe, he was talking hard on that dumpster. Girl, you wouldn't know it. Like, if you didn't know him and you just <laughs> went, you would not know. Ugh. Mel, Mel got some new tracks. Girl, cuz. You just wouldn't know it. Sue Abs Ab, do she agree with Whip? What's Sue? The one Sue Wu? She lying with Ab. Who is that? <clears throat> it's a lot of people working in a restaurant just like him. Girl, and that she's in her is she? I ain't know Sue Wu be going over there. And what Ev say? Yeah, she said she agree with her. Oh. Yep, disgusting. Yes, girl, she said it. 
Ev says she don't feel no type of way. Sue said you got kids. Ev mm -hmm. don't feel no kind of way because it's me that bought it out. But for some reason, <clears throat> I don't believe that that was said no months ago. If it was, it just came out. Because it's hard for me to believe that somebody heard that. So, Eb heard that and really felt like, oh, well. Right. Girl, you lying. Girl, I hate when my phone be doing this stupid shit. The one day, it was, it was what? malicious. It was she with malicious intent. She did deliver it. She felt like that. So how do you feel huh? like she shouldn't have delivered it? If she delivered it, if she felt the way that she felt, how the fuck do you feel like she shouldn't I'm have delivered it? I'm confused by what you're saying. No, listen to me. That's, you that's just said. <laughs> not to make it make yeah, sense. But you just said the person that delivered it shouldn't deliver it. But you nobody have should deliver it. it. Nobody shouldn't deliver the fact that they want to suck on a five year old's dick. That ain't what, what I'm talking, talking about. about. I'm not talking nobody about. Nobody shouldn't with. deliver that. No, that's I'm what we're talking about. about, about, about she will. Will. Yes, we're talking about. I'm not. I'm not talking about Auntie Will, bitch. Get the fuck out of my motherfucking face and get down on my fucking box. Trying to argue with me. Oh, look at Sue. Get the fuck down and get out my box trying to argue with me. You don't even know what the fuck you talking about or what the fuck is going on. You talking about Auntie Whip delivering some shit. I'm not talking about Auntie Whip. Amber is slow. I'm not talking about Auntie Wilp, sis. I'm not talking about Auntie Wilp. I said she, the person who delivered it, shouldn't have been delivering it. <laughs> Why not? I'm not talking about Auntie Wilp. Why not? She would have delivered it. Wouldn't she would have delivered it? And you know why it was perfect for me delivering it? Because for some reason, Whip kept saying that I was accusing her of being a child molester. That's why it was perfect for me to deliver it. And I did. Yeah, she wants to overlook the fact that Whip said it. Yeah. Why would I be mad at a bitch that's been talking about me for two, three years? So, Girl, what are you talking about? Girl, bye. Sue must got some... Why are you talking about, Sue? You don't even make sense. Girl, bye. I think she under the influence. Got to be. Well, we know you are, honey. You can't make it through without it. <laughs> she can't make it through without it, girl. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Bye, Magnificent. She under the influence. Because I don't know what the fuck she talking about. She been jumping in everybody box, arguing with them. She been jumping in everybody box, arguing with them. Um, I don't know who is that. Um, uh, thought. Oh, I don't know. Is Ned here? I was asking her what happened. Big Ned is Big Ned in here. I saw her kick you. Is that Detroit thought? I saw that, but I was, she was in here. I don't know why. Ever since I've been asking her, I ain't got no response. 
I was like, did something happen or what made him do what made Big Net do that? But she not in here. Is she not in here? Where'd she go? You think it's personal? Net, tell me what happened now. I need to know what happened with you and with uh what's going on with Detroit Thought. Why why you kick him? She probably just don't like his ways. Right, but I don't know. On restriction from who, though? Because he always come in here. That's why I'm like, did something happen? He was just in here. Oh, he was talking about P. Oh. Okay. Okay, I didn't know that. He was talking about P. And you, he's fake. Okay. I didn't see it. So they say you was over there saying something bad about Pastor P. Um, uh, boy, I didn't know that. What? He did it in my life. In my life? Oh, yeah, no, nah, I don't even remember that. I don't know where I was at here. They said it happened. But I ain't going to lie, it be a lot of shit go on in here. And I miss that shit. And it be some deep ass shit. I be like, well, how in the fuck did I miss that? It be some deep shit. I'm serious. Motherfucker be the got they badge took and all kind of shit. And I don't be knowing, like, well, what, what happened? I'm serious. I be the missed it. I, I'm serious. They be done handled all kind of shit down there, child. He said, kick him. I said, kick him out every time. Oh, well. Shit. He put it in here. Right. I don't even be arguing it like shit. If they see a need. But I did. I have forgot that. I didn't know. I I don't even remember saying that here. <laughs> she, but okay. Yeah, I didn't know that. Where's that? If it was in the very beginning, yeah, because I ain't going to lie. In the beginning, I, that shit had me fucked up. I was like, damn. So I might have did forget um, some shit like that. Uh -huh. You think he was asking? I oh, don't know. Now the roach said TV killer doing false tea. Girl, what would be the false tea? And he posting videos of the people, shit the people said. What would be the false tea? She's so weird. What would be the false tea? Oh, girl. She happy truth teller posting her dry lives again. Girl, they just as dry. Dry as a fuck. Takes over Diamond Live. Mm. So, Truth Teller gave Trina B some questions. He had some questions for Trina B. Hold on. 
Did anybody catch that? I missed that. This truth teller addressing Trina B. Listen, listen to her and, and love on her and tell her it's going to be okay, baby. Yo, 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 what up, y'all? It's truth teller, the truth speaker. Y'all know what it is, man. Sunday morning, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to give y'all a quick 15 to 20 minutes, you know what I mean? I'm going to try to keep it, try to keep this short real quick. But um, just a couple of things, man, I just want to point out that I heard over this weekend. And um, yeah, so like I said last Sunday, I'm going to start doing this little Sunday thing. Every Sunday, I give y'all a little 15, 20 minutes of commentary. You know what I mean? Since y'all love my voice so much. And, um, yeah, so. And Trina B is the topic this week. All the other shit is minute compared to this. So this is where we're going to keep it at. All right? So without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to play this little clip. So it is posted on YouTube. Um, <laughs> but... It's not really getting too much attention, so I'm going to give it some attention. Let's go. I'm able to speak to her behind the scenes. I'm able to sit with her and talk with her and ask her questions and, 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 and console to her. Listen to this shit. To her issues concerning how people ridicule and ridicule her family mm. about mm. something that did not even happen to her. Mm. Y'all know who he talking about, the little girl. Bitch, y'all gonna figure when she come out 15 years old, bitch, y'all gonna see a beast. Mm. Cause she said when she turned 15, she coming. Mm. So when she turned 15, she 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 gonna do a national interview on it. And tell you not a national say, interview. I'ma let her, I'ma let her go in. I'ma let her go in. When she turned 15, I'm gonna let her go in. Mm. What 15-year-old wants to talk about being molested as a child? Um. What 15-year-old wants to speak on their father molesting them as a child? What 15-year-old wants to talk about making up a story that got her father locked up. Now, let me just make sure everybody's clear. Little Trina is not this girl's father. However, he is her stepfather. And I say stepfather because her, her mother does have children that are younger than her with little Trina. So he was acting and should have been acting as a father figure. That's why Truth Teller is calling him her father. Because he was definitely, he should have been playing that role in protecting her and all of that. Hey, tell me in the comments. Hey. I'm muted in the comments. Oh. Let me unmute you. Let me go. It is Bigo. There you go. You are muted. Thank you. Muted uh KK a little bit ago. So um that's why he's saying that like that. Not necessarily he's a liar. <laughs> I was saying somebody put down that, that he's a liar. But um through the eyes of the little girl, she would be looking at him as her father figure. And even with how Trina B's talking. Trina B gives it a like he the girl's grandfather and as if he has some say so and it and as if he can you know decipher and tell and dictate you know that's pretty strange too like seriously like you could calm the fuck all the fucking way down like calm all the way down 
You not telling my little girl shit. That's what I was hoping Jasmine, well, I was thinking Jasmine was going to get up in the box and say yesterday. But she didn't. Wasn't that yesterday when she was getting up in Trina box or was that Friday? Yesterday as in Saturday. Mm-hmm. Or, and she has, I believe that little girl was coached. Was that Friday? Because that little girl was telling. Oh, all of them. Trina B is coaching that baby to say what he said. It would gag him if she said the opposite. Well, I don't know why they put so much emphasis on when she's 15. I don't know if that's when his probation would be over. We got to count it up. But I don't know if that's why they're saying she going to talk up when she turned 15. And why 15? He got 10 years probation and he's already done about three. Right? Because it happened in 2019. He probably did two or three. 15 is still a child, though. So I'm wondering, like, why was the age 15 so uh, significant? In jail, if that was the case. You saw, remember, this is the same young lady whose mother chose to protect her, to not let her testify. But now here we have Trina B. Saying he's going to put her in front of lights and cameras and have her do a tell-all when she turns 15 years old, ladies and gentlemen. And right now the young lady is 11. And these are the conversations that Trina B is having with her. Trina B wants to bring her on Bigo to clear his name. Ain't that some shit, ladies and gentlemen? Mm. Mm. And this is the guy who claims to be grandfather of the year. Mm. Even though this is not even his grandchild. Well, that's um, mm. no, well, right. I'm not going to get into all of that. But um, this is the guy who claims to be grandfather of the year. Mm -hmm. Who wants to put this little girl through this. Let's continue. Oh, I'm going to leave. Oh, I, I bet, I'm gonna say, baby, you can cuss them out, say all, everything you want to say to them. I'm a, ain't nobody gonna tell you not to. Whatever oh. you feel. Oh. Curse them out. He's gonna encourage your mind to curse. Oh. Let's keep Let's continue. You're gonna be able to do it. Because at the end of the day, at the end of the day, it was you. You dealt with it. You have to deal with this, uh, 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 um, uh, uh, um, this, this blame, and I can't wait till she turns fifteen years old. Whoa! I bring her and say her right beside. Whoa! She has to deal with this blame. Now you know what. <laughs> now you know what. Somebody'll be real dirty, real dirty, if they sent that in to the probation officer and to the court. To the DA. Somebody will be real dirty. Because he's still on. Uh, uh, um, probation. Somebody will be real. Oh, they're swept. When they protecting the child. I said that right before he let that come out his mouth. I said the only reason that little girl would go on, get on here, going off and doing all of that is if he plant seeds in her head before she get on here and say, these people said this about you. These people said that about you. Get on here and curse them out. She not even going to know what she on here cursing people out about. Right. Because that's how he works. 
Right. He would have to coach her. It's Bigo. She don't know nothing about Bigo. But the way he talking, it's like they have informed her about Bigo. And I'm wondering why is, if that's going on, why is Jasmine? See, for me, it all go back to Jasmine because that's her mother. She's the only blood relative involved with that little girl in particular. She's the only blood relative involved. That boy is not her daddy. It's like, why do she keep failing her? Okay, you don't, you don't. Even if he didn't do nothing, he been accused of it and convicted of it. Something done, something happened. Keep him away from her. Like, what is your problem? Unfit. That's the definition of an unfit mother. These are the ones y'all supposed to be going hard on. People like that. Like, ugh. Ugh. He probably ain't talk to that little girl. Who, Trina? Shit. From the text messages and um, out of Trina's own mouth, he said that um, Neil had still been coming around. Had still been coming around them. You know, yes, he he has two kids, two kids with uh, Jasmine. <clears throat> not just uh, not just uh, that Bella. It's another little baby younger than Bella. Way uh, uh, younger than Bella. All of this happened after the sexual assault. Thank you. All this happened after the sexual assault. Mm-hmm. They had Bella. And then, you know, he got convicted and everything. And it seemed like once he got done with that, that they got pregnant with the little baby, with the little boy. Now, the only thing I'm wondering, we're going to get back to the video. Only thing I'm wondering is, does that little girl live with, yes, the Caucasian little boy? The one I always be like, do not look nothing like Trina now. So that means that little girl still been, yes. And those text messages actually reveal it because there was uh, times where um, they got into it. Little Trina and Jasmine and um, uh, Big Trina was tr having to mediate. I'm telling you, Marie Marie. Cause, but remember, I came live and said it. I came live, and it was last winter, and said that he was there. We didn't see him for three or four days after that. I believe he was traveling back. Even in the text, he tell the route that he go back to Georgia. Hey, Hershey. Mm hmm Yeah. And Trina B warns him like they know. He said Pastor P and Tommy K know. Neil is little Trina. 
That's his, you know, their middle, they got the exact same name. Brian O'Neill Williams. One is spelled a different way. O'Neill is spelled differently. That's the only difference in their name. And that boy, he did admit Trina B. been using his name. But let's get back to this video. I'm going to let her go in. When she turned 15, I'm going to let her go in. Mm. What 15-year-old wants to talk about being molested as a child? Right. What 15-year-old? wants to speak on their father molesting them as a child. Mm -hmm. Not murder. What 15 year old wants to talk about making up a story that got her father locked up right. in jail if that was the case. You so all remember this is the same young lady whose mother chose to protect her to not let her testify mm -hmm. but now here we have trina b mm -hmm. saying he's gonna put her in front of lights and cameras and have her do a tell-all when she turns 15 years old mm -hmm. ladies and gentlemen and right now the young lady is 11. Sick fuck. And these are the conversations that trina b is having with her Coach and I get up. Trina B wants to bring her on Bigo to clear his name. Uh -huh. Ain't that some shit, ladies and gentlemen? Plans to be grandfather of the year. BK. Hey. Okay. Why you the girl? This dry. Why you being mean to me? Hey, boo. What's up? Not for real. I don't know what you been on, sister. Child, get out. We watch that. Even though this is not even his grandchild, uh, you know, well, I'm not even going to get into all of that. <laughs> but um, this is a guy who claims to be grandfather of the year who wants to put this little girl through this. And let's continue. Oh, I'm going to never go in. Oh, I, I bet, I'm going to say that you can cuss him out, Phil, everything you want to say to him. I'm a, ain't nobody going to tell you not to. Whatever you feel. Curse him out. He's gonna encourage a minor to curse. Let's keep. Let's continue. You gonna be able to do it. Cause at the end of the day, at the end of the day, it was you. You dealt with. Yes, Queen Brown. You have to deal with this. Uh, uh, hey, uh, 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 this, this blame. And I can't wait till she turns fifteen years. I'm gonna make sure I bring her. She has to deal with this play. Mm. This is young ladies, ladies and gentlemen. Right now, she's 11. She what has to deal with this play. This is what happened in what, 2020? And, 2019? Yeah. And you see, Trina is really trying to be careful with his words. And this is still the stupid shit that comes out his mouth. I can't wait to hear from the messy caller. Y'all know the messy caller that calls? Oh, honey, I want to hear from you, sweetie. Hell, I, 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 who? Come on, man. Mm. This happened approximately four years ago. Mm -hmm. She was seven at the time. No, let's continue, man. Damn. So, so she can tell y'all everything. Matter of fact, I'll walk away for her to tell y'all everything she got to tell you. Oh, wow. I can wait till the day she turned 15 years old. Mm. I just got four more years. I can't wait until the day she turned 15 four more years. years old. Come on, man. This is what Trina's waiting for. Sick bitch. He's not waiting for her to to to, to graduate. Get to high He's not Come on, to get into college. Right. He's, He's not waiting to do something nah, positive. Exactly. He's not waiting to do anything positive. Exactly. Cesspool, son of a bitch. Uh, 
he's waiting until she turns 15 to bring her back to her troubled childhood. Let's continue. Hey, but that's our mind frame now. You hear that? Motherfuckers. That's a lie, Trina. How can she be sick of people she's never seen or met? How can she be exactly. sick of people you when you have to be 18 to, to be on this app? Eat this motherfucking ass up, truth teller. Because you know what? It need, that's what I be saying, that men need to step up and check this chump at this point. You see what I'm saying? At this point, he has annihilated the women. I mean, look at what the hell he said and done to us, okay? Now he's turning around, and to me, this is a blow in every victim's face. This is this is a this a heavy hit here to me. Where you sitting up in front of people asking for gifts, thinking this the content to use. Just to humiliate this little girl again, it really is like it's a it's a it's a slap in the face to really any any uh survivor of this like that is crazy. Look at how he manipulating this. Oh boy! Why are you subjecting this minor to what's going on on Bigo? Exactly. You, her mother, her father, whoever the fuck. Is subjecting this minor to Beagle after she's already been through so much. Why would y'all be putting this young child through the trauma of Beagle? How can she be tired of anybody who's on Beagle? If that's the case, you should be, get off Beagle. Her mother should get off Beagle, and her father should get off Beagle. If it's if it's gone to the to the point where your child is traumatized by the people on Beagle at 11 years old when she shouldn't even know what the fuck a Beagle is, is a problem. Right. That alone is fucking neglect. Right. A child is being subjected to something they should not be subjected to. Just like you sit and let the fucking baby eat dog food. Right. That's neglect. You should not be subjecting your child to this. They should not be exposed to it. Just like they should. That's right. And why would that little girl reach down to the dog trough and pick up? Yes, honey. One day Trina B in his life said that Bella reaches down in the dog trough and sometimes had her nibble or two of the dog food, bitch. Says sometimes she have her little taste, a little craving for her a little bit of that dog food down there. And she reached down there and get her a few pebbles like it's snack time. Now he got mad at me because he said that. And they want to blame me. But see, he called, he said, look what he said my kids be in here doing. So he made up stuff on about me. I used the truth on him. You said that Bella eat the dog food. I'm just wondering what is was Bella hungry? What made Bella be that greedy or is she just greedy with them three scoops of hair? What, what you know, which one is it, Trina? Is she is she what is she just hungry? Like some kids just be hungry. I think she's a hungry little girl. Three scoops. She ain't got but a few strands up there. They don't never have no bar reds or have her really fixed up or nothing. She put on one little old uh, Walmart dress and honey Trina. See, look at her. He had the gall to put his child in the lineup with, with my grown child. He put that little girl. Ooh, let me go back. They shouldn't have been exposed to being molested or sodomized or even been exposed to telling lies about it. Come on, what, what That's is going right. on with this, with, in this child's life? That we have a step-granddaddy, <laughs> not even a blood-granddaddy. Right. 
We got the step granddaddy on here talking about he's going to put a next on his knee at 15 years old. Honey, a step granddaddy who ain't, ain't worth two crying quarters, honey, who ain't worth nothing, who ain't ain't uh, got a pot to piss in and a window to throw it out of. A step granddaddy who already was born, bred, and raised in a cesspool. A step granddaddy, honey, that if you never ever saw him again in your life, sweetie, you wouldn't be missing out on anything. And I'm wondering what it is about. Uh, uh, what's this girl's name? Jasmine. Where is her mama? Her mama ain't got enough sense to be telling her, girl, keep my grandbaby away from them folks. The son and the girl not even married. Well, you know, exactly. They weren't married. They just got two kids together. So he will, I guess, sickly be a part of this girl's life. He do got kids with Jasmine. So that girl is going to see him. But she should not ever encounter him in her own home. The fact Trina say step grandfather Trina is trying to distance himself. No, that's not Trina saying that. That's truth teller talking. So this is truth teller uh, recapping Trina B's live. Trina B doesn't never stay say step grandfather. He actually has not put a relationship to it. He haven't. He just spitting out dictations and shit as if he what he say yesterday is this might be is this the video he said grandbaby about Bella or about the victim because the victim is Bella's big sister oh oh wow he's even well, that's sick too. I don't know. I don't know because I don't see how he could be even acting as a grandfather to her. No. No, both not victims of, of Latrina's. Mm -mm. Both not victims of Latrina's. I thought in that lie when he said it. This is the video I believe that you plan. Let's go back. Let's rewind this and, and hit this again. I'm starting from the very beginning. I'm going to shut the fuck up. For all I can tell you, motherfuckers, and that y'all don't do a motherfucker thing because I got hands on you. Y'all is watchers looking in. I have hands on, hands on when it comes to that. I'm able to listen, listen to her and, and love on her and tell her it's going to be okay, baby. Yo, 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 what up, y'all? It's truth telling the truth speaker. Y'all know what it is, man. Sunday morning, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to give y'all a quick 15 to 20 minutes, you know what I mean? I'm try to keep it, try to keep this short real quick. But um, just a couple of things, man, I just want to point out that I heard over this weekend. And, um, yeah, so like I said last Sunday, I'm going to start doing this little Sunday thing. Every Sunday, I give y'all a little 15, 20 minutes of commentary. You know what I mean? Since y'all love my voice so much. And, um, yeah, so. And Trina B is the topic this week. All the other shit is minute compared to this. So this is where we're going to keep it at. All right, so without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to play this little clip. So it is posted on YouTube, um, but it's not really getting too much attention, so I'm going to give it some attention. Let's go. I'm able to speak to her behind the scenes. I'm able to sit with her and talk with her and ask her questions and, and, and console to her when she going through her little issues concerning how people ridicule is really killing her family. Oh. 
something that did not even happen to her. Oh. Bitch, y'all gonna figure when she come out 15 years old, bitch, y'all gonna feel peace. Because she said when she turned 15, she coming. She said when she turned 15, she said she, she gonna do a national interview on it. Wow, girl. And tell y'all, whatever thing she said, I'm gonna let her. I'm gonna let her go in. I'm gonna let her go in. When she turned 15, I'm gonna let her go in. What 15 year old wants to talk about being molested right. as a child? What 15 year old mother locked up in jail if that was the case? You so saw, remember, this is the same young lady whose mother chose to protect her to not let her testify. Right. But now here we have Trina B saying he's going to put her in front of lights and cameras and have her do a tell-all when she turns 15 years old, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. And right now the young lady is 11. And these are the conversations that Trina B is having with her. Trina B wants to bring her on Beagle oh. to clear his name. Oh. Ain't that some shit? Uh -huh. And this is the guy who claims to be grandfather of the year. Oh. Even though this is not even his grandchild. Uh, you know, well, I'm not even going to get into all that. But, um, this is a guy who claims to be grandfather of the year. Who wants to put this little girl through this. Oh. Let's continue. Oh, I'm going to let her go in. Oh, I, I bet, I'm going to say, baby, you can cuss him out, feel everything you want to say to him. I'm a, ain't nobody going to tell you not to. Whatever you feel. Curse him out. He's going to encourage a minor to curse. Let's keep him. Let's continue. You're going to be able to do it. Because at the end of the day, at the end of the day, it was you. Oh. You dealt with it. You have to deal with this, uh, 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 um, uh, um, this, this blame. And I can't wait till she turned 15 years. I'm going to make sure oh. I bring her and say her rep stop. She has to deal with this blame. Oh. This is young ladies, ladies and gentlemen. Right now, she's 11. When this happened, I think she was 9, 8. This is what happened in what, 2020, 2019? Come on, man. This happened approximately four years ago. So if she 11, she, she was, was seven. She was seven at the time. Now, let's continue, man. Oh. So she can tell y'all everything. Matter of fact, I'll walk away for her to tell y'all everything she got to tell you. Damn. I can't wait till the day he would leave her in front of the Beagle screen by herself. I just got four more years. At 15. I can't wait until the day she turns 15 years Trina ain't old. shit. Come on, man. This is what Trina's waiting for. He ain't about shit. He's not waiting I for never her told to, him to, nothing to, about to my family. He's not waiting for never. her to go to college. I ain't going to leave her alone. That's what he's waiting to do. Something nah, she decided positive. that she don't want to do it when she's 15. He's not waiting to do anything positive. Just for being. He's waiting until she turns 15 to bring her back to her troubled childhood. Let's continue. But that's our mind frame now. She's sick of you motherfuckers. How? That's a lie, Trina. How can she be sick of people she's never seen or met? What? How can she be sick of Beagle at 11 years old when you have to be 18 to, to be on this app? So they be letting her hit this shit. This minor to what's going on and on probably Beagle. be telling you, see what you got them saying you, about your daddy. Nigga fuck. ain't even your this daddy. This minor to he Beagle. don't even give a fuck. After she's Ooh. already been through so much, why would y'all be putting this young child through the trauma of Beagle? How could she be tired of anybody who's on Beagle? If that's the case, you should get, get off Beagle, her mother should get off Beagle, and her father should get oh, off Beagle. Oh. If it's if it's gone to the to the point where your child is oh. traumatized by the people on Beagle at eleven years old when she shouldn't even know 
what the fuck a bingo is, right. is a problem. That alone is fucking neglect. Mm -hmm. Your child is being subjected to something they should not be subjected to. Just like you sit and let the fucking baby eat dog food. That's neglect. Mm -hmm. You should not be subjecting your child to this. They should not be exposed to it. Just like they shouldn't have been exposed to being molested or sodomized. Or even been exposed to telling lies about it. Come on, what, what is going on with this with, in this child's life? That we have a step granddaddy, not even a blood granddaddy. We got this, the step granddaddy on here talking about he's going to put a next on his knee at 15 years old to sit here and tell her story. Come on, man. What kind of sick shit is this, man? Let's continue. Sick she want to do it now, but we won't let her. Oh. She want to do it now, but we won't let her. She want to do it now at 11 years old. We believe you, Trina. If lying like a rug was a person, uh -huh. come on, man. This guy is unbelievable, man. The shit he comes up with, uh -huh. he then looks to the side and looks up. Because she want to clear up the air. Why would she want to clear up the air? I'm going to tell you the two people she um, uh, really hate the most. Uh -huh. God, Zeus, and Ebony. Uh -huh. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, ladies and gentlemen. Trina B is exposing himself. Let me tell you how he's exposing himself. Why the fuck would his granddaughter know, his step granddaughter know what the fuck a God Zeus or Ebony is? Why? When that God Zeus did him? meet him, why? Let them tell it. The mother, the mother wasn't even on Bigo. This is Trina thing. Trina's the one saying. God Zeus claimed she met by uh. <laughs> He's the one who supports family. his family by Bigo, Bigo. So I know if anybody is subjecting that child to right. Bigo, it's Trina B. He's the one who sits there and does lives all day while the grandchildren are right there. He's the one who just prances around in wigs and la, 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 does all yeah. that shit for Bigo while the grandkids in are right front of there. Them kids. So if anybody's subjecting this child to Bigo, I know it's Trina B. Mm. Oh, who was subjecting this child to Bigo, I know it was Trina B. And now that I think about it, this must, this must be the same little girl who asked a little while back, um, what's she, she, uh, what do you call him, Papa Stank? What do you call him, Stank, Stank, whatever Stanker. they call him, Trina B, Stank? Stank. Granddaddy Stank, some shit they call him anyway. I forgot what they call him, but anyway. She said, why you got on makeup and a dress? Oh. Uh. She asked him this on live. Why are you wearing makeup and a dress? Little girl was com confused as fuck. Uh-huh. Confused as fuck. Mm -hmm. That's so why Trina B was sitting there dancing in a wig, makeup, and a dress. She asked her right online. Mm -hmm. So this must be the same little girl who he's claiming doesn't like our Zeus and Ebony and is sick of the people on Bigo. Mm -hmm. Is this the little girl who he's exposing to mm -hmm. adult material? This, that's like showing a little kid porn. Mm -hmm. If you let your little kid be on Beagle, letting them see Beagle, you might as well open up a Playboy magazine for him or a Hustler magazine. Right. Or take him or, or, or sit him down in front of, of a computer and put on uh, X Hamster or X Porn or, uh, you know, any, any one of them X rated websites. If you're going to put them on here and let them look at fucking Beagle. Right. Come on, man. You can't be serious. Let's continue. I don't know why it is. It's God, Zeus, and Ebony. For some reason, she don't like God, Zeus, and Ebony. God, Zeus, and Ebony. Mm. And 11 year old. She don't like God, God Zeus, and Ebony. And that is facts. Them are the mm. main facts. I swear to God on my kid. I swear to God on she don't so like God, been, Zeus, and Ebony. That must have been, she must have been not liking him since she was like nine years old, eight years old. And she don't like Ashley. Fuck. What? And she, oh, and another one. How Ashley. long she been watching? That's another reason why I know it's Trina who's subjecting these kids oh. to this. But two people she don't like for some reason oh, no. God, Zeus. Her mother, oh. these are the people that her mother allegedly also don't like. Oh. Or who's, uh was trying to avoid on Beagle. Oh. Ashley, Ed. So, I, we know that she's not sitting at home watching Beagle, got, got the kids sick of fucking Beagle. That's Trina B. Oh. And Ebony. 
I don't know why. She says two people. I don't. I guess she's seen the videos of them. Oh. I said, why you don't like them two? I said, I just don't like them. I just don't like them people. I just don't like them two. I asked again, why you oh. mention them two people name? She don't like God, Zeus, and Ebony. Uh, uh, let me me pause just for a second because I gotta change this headphone. I don't know if y'all are hearing that buzzing, but uh, I hear buzzing. I think it's this headphone, so let me change it. Hold on. Wow. She do not like God, Zeus, or Ebony. A kid, a, 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 a minor doesn't like God, Zeus, or Ebony. They shouldn't even know what the fuck God, Zeus, or Ebony is. Oh my. Why does she don't like them two people? This is ridiculous. I don't know why she she even know who them two people is. Why does a child know who them two people is? Exactly. Why? But you can explain that, Trina. No, I ain't tell them about them. No, I never mentioned. I never mentioned nobody about Bigo. So how the fuck they know? How they know the people mean? The kids already know about all this. How? She knows about all this. How? 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 She eleven years old. She knows. Y'all, can we try to close this box out for the time change? Bigo is in the 18 year old. 18 you years old. You can pop this box out. App. What you mean you don't know? No stuff, but she know, and I put this on Bella Life. Man. I swear to God, on Bella Life, I put this on Bella Life. Oh, like she know. First of all, stop swearing on the fucking kids' lives, man. The grandpa. Stop swearing on them kids' lives. Oh, all you do is sit up here and lie all day, every day, swearing on little Bella and little Zaya, telling nothing but fucking lies. Trina, man, are you serious, Thank man? Stop. You, Come on, man. Come on, man. This is ridiculous, man. Yes, it is. This is ridiculous, man. This is ridiculous, man. Do I even have to speak to a grown man like this? Yes, it is. Thank you, nice for what? Come on, man. Get your sit together, man. You know, everything about me, y'all. Everything about what we said. Thank you, Shanice. I need to know, man, why? That's, like I said saying before, that's just like, uh... Thank you, so. that's, that's a form of neglect. It's improper supervision. Completely. Just like it's improper supervision when you realize that the, your grandchild is, is munching on Alpo. Uh-huh. Uka Thank Luba. you. Exactly. Whatever's was laying there on the floor for the dog. <laughs> These are, this is, this is why, you know, you shouldn't even be babysitting. You shouldn't be watching them kids uh -huh. at all. Because you've proven to be neglectful. Uh -huh. You've proven to not supervise these kids properly. And you've proven to even influence them and put them and put things in front of their faces that they should not be, uh, should not be seen. Should not have privy to. Yeah, thank you, boo. They shouldn't know what a Bigo is. Shouldn't know what an Ab is. Shouldn't know what an Ashley is. They shouldn't be wanting to clear their name on Bigo at, at 11 years old. Right. Come on, people. Come on. Right. Come on, That's man. And y'all admin, y'all y'all admin. Come on, man. I'm asking y'all, y'all still sitting up there and condoning this. Exactly. I'm told, who, who, who's these, who, who are these people, man? City's finest. S Fire. Uh, what a dog. Uh, that must be that person, idiots, S Fire, that he buys that money from. fucking idiot all day long. They condone the lies. They condone the 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 the, the exploitation of kids. Mm -hmm. They condone this. Mm -hmm. They condone Thank the you. trashing of black women. Mm -hmm. They condone this all day long. And no matter what yeah, this man yeah, says, no matter okay. what this man do, right. they still right there supporting them for support. Now I'm glad some of these people have woken. Dynamite woke up. Uh -huh. I don't know if Dynamite will until how could you even give this man twenty thousand dollars is what the fuck I wanna know. Uh -huh. And I 
And after all of that, you donated over 20K to this man, and then look at that. You can't even speak the truth in his room. Right. You can't even speak your own mind. Right. Because as soon as you said, Trina, that's not what you said. What he do? Get dynamite out of here. Right. Get him the fuck out of here. I don't care if he donated over $20,000 in gifts to me. Right. Are you serious? 20K in gifts? Oh. Huh. Have you given your children 20K in gifts? Well, no. Have you given your wife 20K in gifts? You giving Trina B 20K in gifts? That's the weird but I'm part. A People can support who the fuck they want to support. Trina probably was cash shopping that man on the back end, I'm telling you. Trina don't get that kind of support like that. Thank you, Blast. He really doesn't. He probably was cash shopping that man on the back end. But you're supporting... Molestation, you're supporting pedophilia, you're supporting uh -huh. exploitation of children, uh -huh. you're supporting the, the, de the de degradation of the black woman. Yeah. There's a lot of things that you're supporting that I just can't support, but I will expose it. Uh -huh. I will expose all of you. And let's continue with this bullshit. Mm. He is really a weird person. And all I'm going to say to you all is that this, my son, was not on the sex registry. And what does that mean? So kiss your ass. So kiss your ass. Plus, the rape kit came in inconclusive, so kiss my ass. Oh. So we all believe. All right, first thing, your son's not on the registry. Oh. Rape kit came back inconclusive. First of all, do you know what inconclusive means? That means that for whatever reason, they couldn't come to a conclusion performing the test, performing the rape. Not prove innocent. For whatever reason, mm -hmm. they may have had insufficient DNA. Uh, There's a lot of different reasons why they come up with inconclusive tests. Why? Maybe they couldn't narrow the, the samples down out of lie. Maybe the baby wasn't. There's a, there's a lot of different reasons why. Yeah, time had gone by. It probably was washed away. But when they do come back inconclusive, that means. And with them knowing lie. ahead of time, let's talk about that a little bit. With them knowing ahead of time, they knew what was going on. I believe the mama knew. Oh, honey, they were having her probably wash her. Uh, they probably, you know, uh, definitely made her bathe. They didn't take her straight on to the doctor and time had gone by. So, but I bet you they knew ahead of time. Mm -hmm. I bet you they knew ahead of time before she spoke up at the school. In your role. Wants to talk about. Oh, fuck. What the fuck? Gentlemen. Trina B is exposing himself. Let me tell you how he's exposing himself. I went back too far. Why the fuck would his granddaughter know? His step granddaughter know what the fuck a god Zeus or Ebony is? Why are they subjecting this child to Beagle? Mm -hmm. Why? The mother, the mother wasn't even on Beagle. This is Trina thing. Trina's the one saying he's the big broadcaster on mm -hmm. Beagle. This is, he kept saying that. The I'm the big broadcaster. Like Beagle, Beagle. That's what was Why making me think like, did they plan Beagle? this? Jasmine getting in the box, definitely. Like the right there. He's the one who uh, made me feel like they had planned it. Right she didn't get in the box subjecting this child to Beagle. Really saying what she should have been saying. Oh, who was subjecting this child to be go? I know it was Trina B. And now that I think about it, this must this must be the same little girl who asked a little while back, um, what you, you uh, what do you call him, Papa Stank? What do you call him, Stank Stank? Whatever they call Trina B, Stank or Granddaddy Stank, some shit they call him anyway. I forgot what they call him, but anyway, 
She said, why you got all the Y'all need like 30 people, 35 people to throw 100 bands. 35 people. Confused as fuck. As for why Trina B was sitting there dancing in a wig, makeup, and a dress. She asked her right online. So this must be the same little girl who he's claiming doesn't like our Zeus and Ebony and is sick of the people on Bika. Thank you, boo. Is this the little girl who he's exposing to adult material? This, that's like showing a little kid porn. Right. If you let your little kid be on Beagle, letting them see Beagle, you, you might Ms. as well open up a Playboy magazine for him or a Hustler magazine. Or take him or, or, or sit him down in front of, of a computer and put on an uh, X hamster or X porn or uh, uh, no, any one of them X rated websites. If you're going to put them on here, let them look at fucking Beagle. Right. Come on, man. You can't be serious. Let's continue. Yeah, that's crazy. I don't know why it is. It's God, Zeus, and Ebony. For some reason, she don't like God, Zeus, and Ebony. God, Zeus, and Ebony. And 11 year old. She don't like God, God Zeus, and Ebony. And that is facts. <laughs> Them are the main facts. I swear to God on my kid. I'm going to go my life. She don't so like God's in Ebony. That must have been, she must have been not liking him since she was like she nine years old, eight years old. Oh. And she don't like Ashley. What? And she don't like another one, okay. Ashley. That's a good trainer. That's oh, the little girl. That's the trainer who's subjecting these kids to, to this. But you mean she don't like, for some reason, oh, yeah. God's in Ebony. Her mother, these are the people that her mother allegedly also don't like, or who uh, was trying to avoid on Beagle. Ashley, Ed. So, and we know that she's not sitting at home watching Beagle, got, got the kids sick of fucking Beagle. That's Channing B. Uh -huh. And Ebony. I don't know why. She says two people. I, don't, I guess you've seen the videos of them. Uh -huh. I said, why you don't like them two? I said, I just don't like them. I just don't like them people. I just don't like them two. I asked again, why you mention them two people's name? She don't like God, Zeus, and Ebony. Uh, uh, let me let me pause this for a second because I gotta change this headphone. I don't know if y'all hearing that buzzing, but uh, I hear a buzzing. I think it's this headphone, so let me change it. Hold on. A kid, a, 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 a minor mm -hmm. doesn't like God's Zeus or Ebony. I think it's been all of them brainwashing her. Why is she don't like them two people? I don't know why she even know who them two people is. Why does a child know who them two people is? Right. Why? But you can explain that, Trina. No, I ain't telling about them. No, I've never mentioned I've never mentioned nobody about Bigo. So how the fuck I'm they know about how they know the people? How would that little girl know about Bigo? She knows about all this. How? She knows about all this. How? How? Because they train. How? She knows. How? She's 11 years old. She knows. How? How? Bigo is in an 18-year-old. I know my 11-year-old year old know because of me. What you mean you don't know? She knows, but she knows, and I put this on Bella Life. Man. I swear to God, on Bella Life, I put this on John Gear in her life. She knows. First of hey, all, stop swearing on them kids' lives. Boo. Stop hey. swearing on them kids' lives. All you do is sit up here and lie all day, oh, every day, man. swearing on little Bella and little Zaya, telling nothing but fucking lies. Trina, man, are you She's serious? 11 man, years old Come now. On, yep. Come on, man. This is ridiculous, man. This is ridiculous, man. This is ridiculous. No, man. that's my bro. He he's a time fan. He be making uh, man like this. He be making raps. Come on, man. <laughs> Get your sit together, man. That's my bro. About what be said. I need to know, man. Why? That's like I was just saying before. That's just like uh, that's that's a form of neglect. It's improper supervision. 